couple of volunteers. Yeah, can you come up? And then Jacob, right? Here, Jacob. Okay. Here. Okay. Can you slide these on for me? I want to show you guys how to properly put on your life jackets. Everyone has to wear life jackets. It's not just you guys, it's me too. And that's for our safety. Here you go. Here you go. Yeah. You can buckle that on up. Okay, so it, it's pretty straightforward. <laughs> Some of you will have zippers, some of you will have buckles. You just want to make sure all your buckles are buckled, all your zippers are zipped up. Okay? Got it. Here we go. So top and top, bottom and bottom. There you go. And turn around towards the group. That way they can see you. And so you can tell this is very, very big on me. If I were to go in the water and I didn't know how to swim, even if I didn't know how to swim, it was really deep water, this would be all over my head, and that's not good. So we always want to take anything that we can and make it as tight as possible on us. Oh, gotta put his glasses up. Got your buckles right? Good. Very good. So you want to stand, your straps are in the front. So that's nice and easy. You want to turn around real quick? Show, show it off to everybody. You're good. So we want to get it as tight as possible. Always wear a life jacket that fits you. Is that pretty snug? And tighten it up as much as possible. Do you think you can do it? So take this in your right hand. Come here, Jane. If you, we've got to show everybody how to do it properly. You did it right. Very good. So you want to take your strap and pull it as much as possible until it's nice and tight. Okay. And the way that you'll know if it's tight enough, see this might look good on me, but it's still gonna go up over my head. So you always wanna lift it up and see, it you might need to be tighter. And these are gonna make you hot, but they also might save your life. So that's why we always have these. Um, we all know they're called life jackets. We call them PDFs sometimes, personal flotation device. And that's just so we can have fun out there without having to worry. Um, I saw everyone put their sunblock on. Very, very good. That's very important. I've seen people on canoes just for an hour that come back completely crisp and sunburnt. That's good. Does everyone have water? Water is very important out there. Stay hydrated. You'll be able to have no. fountain over here. I have free water. So if you guys want it. I don't say they're going to be out there that long. You guys can do that together. Um, water is very important out there. Now I want to show you a little bit about a uh, They were out there for just an hour. Can I, could you help me out here? Like, we're gonna be out there. Yeah, you too. Yeah. Is that okay? Yeah. I'm not going. You're not so going? Here you go. I'm gonna Why? show them first and then I'll hand you a I don't like paddle. water. <laughs> sometimes we have them that are Stay right smaller here. or larger yeah. and they can help you out. Are you left handed or right handed? What? Right handed. Okay. So I'm you're going to take your right hand and put it on the ground and grip it up here with your left hand. Does everybody see that? You don't want to go out there either? Gripping it like this. I'll do it. If you are I know you left do. handed, that means your left hand's stronger and you want it down below and you'll put your Listen, right hand up might here. Make you. Okay? You Does might. that feel all right? So, good, you know, strong hold on the top here with your left hand. Look at one. The other hand, yeah. And then grab it down below. And we can make so kind of a box with, with our oars. And when we're paddling, we'll put it all the way in the water Usually. and bring it all the way back so we're not splashing people behind us. Do you want to try it? I think so. To take you up listen, time. Yeah, show everybody. You can do it. Mm -hmm. I know it's kind of big on you. We can get you guys smaller paddles. Are you left-handed or right-handed? That's why I went one of the older kids. Which hand do you write with? Mm -hmm. I said, she said the little kids might tip her over. <laughs> I said, that's why I went well, with I'm going to assume it's your right hand. So stand doing. towards the crowd and let everybody see you do it. Grab your, with your left Kennedy. hand real strong. Yeah. I'll take Sydney. Got it? There you go. Strong hand on the bottom. Yes, Sydney. And you're going to take it, if you were in the boat, take it next exactly to the boat, Mario. all the way in the water, and bring it all the yeah. way back. Those are and too we do solid that really slowly sides. so we don't hit yep. anybody Sydney, and so we don't Kennedy. splash anybody. I don't want to take <laughs> No. If he's got a double sided paddle when you're by yourself, that that it's one much one easier one. to have a paddle like that. The where little you can go one. back and forth. Oh no. You guys Mario all want to be just talking a about partner that, today. Both exactly so the one of same. you will sit they in the front really of the bow. Yeah. We call it the bow. It's one just of a you little will sit in the back. Yes. That's called the stern. If you're yes. in the back, you should probably be the stronger or See, bigger Taylor person. Did. It's just when you um, this is other so that uh, you can steer the boat. The boat is steered from the back seat, not 
the yes. front seat. I stayed till front seat six, helps push forward. And if he wasn't around, turns. all the little kids, he was. So hopefully you all get some different. practice in that. Really? Quiet, um, just playing with. Other things he was saying, maybe yes, to remember no, 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 is that if you don't know how to swim, always go with an adult. <laughs> Hate it. Always. I was like, wow. Um, even if, if you do know how oh, to swim, no always get someone in your group who's experienced. If your boat accidentally turns over and you don't know how to tip it right, then that can be really dangerous. So if you don't know how to swim, go with an adult. Even if you do know how to swim, have a partner so that you can tip your boat back right. 